I dope in the bush. Dope in the bush. I know how to do Hello, good morning. If this is your first time to my channel, my name is Erica. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel, girl. If you like the content, if you like me, you like what you see, you like what we doing, then consider subscribing. I would love to have you. It is pretty much just gonna be a shopping day. I want to get my outfits together. I heard some clothes off a pretty little thing like a couple of days ago but i want to go to the mall i want to go to zara and i want to hit up some other places so instead of going to tyson's we may go to tyson's but i think we're just going to go to this place called the pentagon center or something it's like another mall but i like their zara better than i like the zara and tyson's and see what other stores and stuff they have around there i'm actually going with one of my friends simone um it's so funny like we just met the other night we actually were in dc hanging out we went to like some lounge and then we also went um to grab like a little bite to eat um but yeah so that's who i'm actually going to be going on my little shopping day with we're gonna make a full day of it i have so many errands to run today so i figured why not pick up the camera so this stuff is in preparation for your girl's 30th birthday i'm so excited yeah so i want to go get some stuff and y'all are gonna get to see simone go to the mall do some shopping i have to get all of these jeans tailored in the back of me guys these are like four pairs of zara jeans that i got months ago that i have to get tailored i have to get them taken up because they're way too long and i have to get them taken in because your girl waist is like snatch delicious okay so i gotta get that waist taken in um so i'm gonna try to take them to my alteration lady and see what she says um like if she can like you know like how much she's about to charge me because alterations are not cheap but then i also found another person um who said that she could do it right now i'm actually at the post office because i have packages that i need to drop off you know what i'm gonna go in i'm just gonna go in because i do have this box so let's do this first drop these packages off so if you order something over the weekend when we launched our milani minx glosses then your order is being shipped out today i got this bag full of orders so grateful thank you guys so much too who shopped i'm so appreciative um but i'm about to run in here really quickly so packages have officially um been shipped off so excited i don't know what the hell was going on with the um with the thing inside the post office like it wouldn't let me pull it down i don't know child okay oh my god y'all my lip gloss smells so good it feels so good outside i have on this two-piece um little sweater short set it's this cute like patchwork i guess i don't know pink sweater and it came with like the matching shorts super cute i think i got this set from misguided it says it's gonna take me about like 40 minutes to get to the mall hopefully it's not any traffic like any crazy traffic at least ah i need to put my i need to put my rings on i kind of already bought my birthday gift for myself last night i have been eyeing this bag that i've been wanting for a while but they're like very hard to find in stores because they're like older bags now but yeah but it's the balenciaga motocross classic city bag i think that's the name classic city bag i've been wanting that bag for a while i kind of decided that was just going to be one of my birthday gifts to myself and i went ahead and bought the bag last night a one that was like 2100 like they're a uh, girl they they kind of pricey they can get kind of pricey um but like i said they're super hard to find in the stores because they're not new like they're not brand new bags so they're not just going to be accessible in a store I got mine off the real real they it was two of them that i actually was kind of contemplating going back and forth with but i kind of wanted one that didn't have like silver hardware because most of them a lot of them have silver hardware i got a black one um but the 
the one that I got has like brass hardware so it's not like gold gold like a gaudy cheap gold um, but it's not silver be either because I don't wear silver accessories or anything so yeah so I got that I'm super excited for that to come um, it should be here by like Tuesday or Wednesday because I got express shipping but I just wanted a classic like black top handle everyday luxury bag you know but something that had some space in it so blessed you guys like I truly truly feel so so blessed like I just feel so so good like I feel so good and just so grateful and just like just so favored you know like I just I thank God every day like every day every night like just thank you thank you for everything thank you for the little things thank you for the big things thank you for the good things the bad things like I just did not think by 30 I would literally be running a business you know like and this shit is just so much deeper than just selling cosmetics you know like Milani Minx means so much to me it's like my fifth baby you know and it's doing so well like we are doing so well like sales daily shipping orders daily like and I just love it so much I feel like in a way I've kind of just found myself again doing something that I just love so much and just have such a amazing passion for because girl I'm not girl we got some good products okay I'm not even about to hold you like the gloss y'all the gloss is popping okay like the gloss is popping like I'm so ready for y'all to get y'all hands on y'all stuff we're gonna have a full day of vlogging y'all I'm not I'm not even about to hold y'all I'm gonna do a good job vlogging today okay so we're about to meet up with Simone and then we're gonna take you from there girl we're gonna take it from here Oh, Simone got me hangry. I, I don't have I'm hangry, y'all. First of all, y'all, I understand my friend had a little situation pop up. Oh, but goddamn, y'all. She, I didn't literally went to all the damn stores. Then she come. My arms hurt. My back hurt. I'm hungry. I got I'm other. In bag. I have other errands to run. Oh my god. I still have to get my jeans tailored. Oh my god. Yes. A friend don't care. She don't care about. Ooh, it's so bright. I see the light. Natural. Sunlight. Yeah. 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 I don't remember where I put my car. All I know is I turned into the parking garage. I got my little ticket, and that was that. I love this mall. I like this mall better than Tyson. I'm about to fuck this ramen up. I paid $20 for a charger because I'm an but, irresponsible little. But no, 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 no. you're responsible. It says it's I'm made gonna... for iPhone, iPad, and iPod. Simone, they're all made. For... No, no. What? I'm telling you because the one that I have, you know how I be going in and out on you? No. got the cutest you guys i literally found the cutest outfit okay so 
the first time I went to Zahar, I went in the Pentagon Mall, I think it's what it's called. But then there's like a um, Zara like in DC, like kind of on the side of the street or whatever, like downtown. So I went in that one, y'all. I found the cutest outfit. So I'm about to go downstairs, drink me some emergency, fill up my water bottle, come upstairs, put these clothes away. Actually, I probably won't because I just don't feel like it. I honestly will probably just throw the clothes in the czar bag and throw the bag in my closet for right now because I'm lazy. <laughs> and then I'm going to show you guys what I got from Sephora. And then I just want to chill. I just want to take a bubble bath and just relax, y'all. Seriously. I guess I can also show you the um, jewelry that I got from Auto. Um, y'all, I got these sl new slippers. They are so freaking comfortable, you guys. Like, terrible. Look at my... Okay, first of all, look at my... Look at my toes. He did such a good job on my toes. My little fat feet. Like, I like to see nail. I want to see t toenail. Like, I don't want to see no meat. So, like, he cut him a little, little shorter, but... They'll grow out. But he did such a good job. I'm obsessed with this color. But yeah, I love pink. Y'all know I love pink on my toes. So, yes. I'm about to go downstairs. I'm going to show you guys what I got from Sephora. Because, girl. Okay, so originally, I went in there to just re-up on two things, y'all. I wanted to get two things. I wanted to get a foundation. And I wanted to get some more of my acne oil. Okay. Y'all gonna see what I got. Tell me y'all. Okay, so this is the um, acne oil that I use. It's the UFO Acne Treatment Face Oil by Sunday Riley. Y'all, this stuff is not cheap, but it is very much worth it. Wait, do I have a receipt to even tell y'all? Oh yeah, I have a receipt so I can tell y'all. Just... For price preference, if you guys are interested in getting anything, um, you know how much it is, girl. Um, this is the 0 0.5, so this isn't even, like, the most expensive one. But I love this stuff. I live by this stuff. This is probably, like, my fourth or fifth bottle of this oil. I feel like I really just see a difference in my skin when I'm using this and like the amount of breakouts that I have or blackheads um, and like how congested my skin is. Like I just feel like when I'm using this oil in my nighttime routine, like I just don't break out like that. Like I just don't. I think the oil is like 50. You know, so this is 40. It's 40. So then I read up on the vitamin C oil so this is by the same brand as you got, can tell by the packaging and this is the ceo glow vitamin c and turmeric face oil to give things like two chances like things that are supposed to like help with acne dark spots stuff like that like i like to give it like two good rounds like two good bottles or jars depending on what it is and the size of it before I'm like, yeah, I really like it. Or like, no, I really don't like it. And then I also got some more of my Kiehl's Clearly Corrective Dark Spot Solution. This is another, um, this is another huge, huge staple in my skincare routine. Okay, so, and then the next two things I picked up are by Fresh. So, I got these toners because the toner that I use, I heard it's like not good if your toners have alcohol in them. Um... So I just kind of wanted to switch it up. The toner's been working for me thus far, but I just wanted to switch it up. So I got these two by Fresh. I got the little travel size ones because I want to try them out before I get the big one. Um, so this one is the Fresh Rose Petal Toner. It's infused with soothing rose water, hydrates, and refreshes. I feel like this is maybe more of like a daytime. Then I also got the Rose Deep Hydration facial toner this is with rose fruit extract it removes impurities and softens um so i got this one as well so the fresh product this is the strawberry not strawberry this is the sugar strawberry exfoliating face wash you guys one 
this smells amazing and two it leaves your skin feeling so soft like your skin literally feels like a baby's bottom like that's how smooth it is like so sometimes when i just want my skin to feel like that i'll go in and i'll cleanse my skin and then i'll go in again with this and like exfoliate right after and then apply my oils and stuff i don't know i feel like doing that like my products just penetrate my skin better and you know because if y'all didn't know you're supposed to do your skincare routine like an hour before you go to bed like, you're not supposed to do your skincare routine and then jump in the bed and be rolling around in your covers and stuff. You try to, you, you should give, like, your skin, like, at least a good, like, hour to absorb the products that you just put on. So, I also went ahead and purchased the Fenty Skin Butter Drop Whipped Oil Cream. I'm actually really excited to try this, so I'm about to, like, pop this out right now. Oh, it smells really good. y'all this smells so good it has like the slightest fragrance to it like like it doesn't leave you feeling like greasy or sticky or anything like i just feel i just feel moisturized Oh yeah, I'm definitely about to hop in the shower and put this on. And then the last thing that I got, and literally the one of the only things I went into Sephora to get, is the NARS Soft Matte Complete Foundation. I have been wanting this foundation for months, and I went into Sephora one time, um, and I got the wrong thing. For some reason, I thought it was the tinted moisturizer. Um, no, not, I didn't, so it wasn't Sephora, it was Ulta. I went to Ulta one time and I thought I got the right thing, but I ended up getting a tinted moisturizer, um, that was literally like $45 and I wish I could return, but I threw the box away. When really I was looking for this foundation and this is actually a Sephora exclusive. So you can only find this in Sephora. I'm in the color Macau, which is medium dark four. So if you want a skin tone reference, girl, if you look like me um and have like a golden undertone then i would try macau but yeah i'm super excited to actually try this foundation i'm gonna take this on my birthday trip and i'm gonna probably use this the next time i go out that's what i got from sephora i'm extremely happy with my purchases I'm gonna try all this stuff tonight once I do my skincare routine and wash my face and stuff. Um, so yeah, so that's it for today.